All right, hello Sage, welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is your next 48 episode, 10 and 11 for Sage, Sun, Moon, Rising in the North Node. All right, so we have the Magician, yeah. I, I feel like there's something going on, all right, uh, between you and an Aries. I feel like an Aries is orchestrating something, all right, yeah. I feel like, I feel like an Aries here is the ringleader. All right, we have, yeah, so I'm, I'm getting like someone's going to make you an offer. You're going to make somebody an offer or somebody's going to apologize for giving you a hard time. I'm also getting to like somebody is trying to make something work. It's just not working. This could be you or somebody's trying to make something happen. It's just not happening. Yeah, we have the Page of Pentacles. Okay, so your work, the Six of Swords. Yeah, so somebody's somebody's gonna move on. I'm getting somebody here in your age bracket. I feel like somebody is somebody is coming back home. I feel like you're going. I feel like you're going back home. You're relo you're relocating back home to your childhood home. Okay, so I feel like somebody's gonna meet you when you get there. This could be your cousin, your sibling. I'm getting you. I'm getting you did find a job, or you're going to be moving for work. Okay, what's the Page of Pentacles? The Knight of Swords, the Moon card, and then we have the Six of Swords, Six of Cups. Yeah, I feel like somebody's moving back home. Or this is what somebody's trying to get you to do. Somebody, I'm getting like somebody's trying to get you to move back home or go back home. What's the moon? But I, I'm kind of getting like somebody's doing this by force with the Knight of Swords. It's almost like somebody's forcing you to do this. Someone's telling you to go back home or go home. All right, get out. Okay, what's the moon card? If this is you, you're telling somebody to get out, go home. All right, what's the moon? I'm definitely getting there's a kid here. I'm getting like somebody here is definitely pregnant. I'm also getting two. Your cycle shows up unexpectedly while you're driving. Your, you know, your menstrual cycle kind of shows up. I'm getting you're not prepared for this. What's the moon card? I don't know why that's important. What's the moon? All right, we have the star, star, ten of wands, nine of cups. Yeah, so I'm getting like somebody's trying to force you out. So I'm getting like somebody could be trying to force you out of a job by making your way hard, stressing you out, picking on you, antagonizing you, term, tormenting you, or this is you because the ten of wands, that's your card. You are the Sagittarius. This is the third deacon of your sign. So you could be you could be in cahoots with somebody else trying to make somebody else's life hard. Because I'm getting a star here, celebrity, a scientist, a scholar, the, the Aquarian card. So I'm getting there's an Aquarian here, ruffling feathers, making everybody's life hard because you know Aquarius rules rebellion. But this is also this could also be um Uranus too. Uranus is Uranus is going, Uranus is back direct. So I'm getting this is why something has stopped working because Uranus is no longer in retrograde. So shocking events, you know, things just getting destroyed out of nowhere. That's over with. I'm getting like the lessons are direct now. So there's new lessons. Okay. So I'm getting, if you keep trying to do something that you did in the past, that's why it's not working. The planets are not in retrograde anymore. I'm getting, it was working before, or that's why it worked. You got lucky. Uh, uh, Uranus just happened to be in retrograde. I'm getting now it's, it, it's, it's direct now. So, so I'm getting like you're somebody, somebody is having a hard time giving you a hard time. I'm getting that's because of the planetary bodies or somebody's having a hard time getting you to come home. So they're going to obstruct your view, obstruct your progress, obstruct your speed. They're going to stress you out. And then when you reach your breaking point, they're going to ask you to come home, ask you to move in or something. The full car. Yes, I'm getting like somebody's an initiate. I feel, like, I feel like you left home, you rebelled, you ran away from home, and your family wants you to come back. How old are you? All right, give, give me a, give, let's go around again. Yeah, I, but, I see, I, I, but I'm getting like your family, your family sees you as like the, uh, as your family, they see you as like a page. Page of pentacles, page of cubs. Like they feel like you, you should be home, you need to be protected, or this is a person that feels like this. You need to be protected, you should be at home, you're a kid. Okay, so maybe you are 18. <laughs> if you're not 18, if you're anything any any older than that, I'm not really okay. What's the moon card? 
or maybe you're, this is your kid. You don't, you don't want your kid to leave home. At least not yet. They're not ready. They're too young. You feel like, yeah, the hangman. So you're going to, you're going to try to create a delay or you're, you're going to make, you're going to create a delay here or a de somebody is creating a delay for you. Someone's trying to delay your happiness. Yeah. So I'm getting like, you're happy. You're, you're, you're having fun. You're enjoying yourself. Someone's going to try to make you see that differently. Somebody wants you to see, somebody wants you to have a different perspective on your life, on the Empress energy or somebody, I'm getting like somebody's trying to change your mind about this person. Somebody's trying to convince you that somebody's evil. Um, somebody's trying, somebody's trying to get you Somebody's trying to get you to think a certain way about a Libran or about your sibling, about your child, something. Yeah, so I'm getting, I'm getting a, the Empress Hermit card. Yeah, so this could, be, this could be one of your followers. It could be your mother. But I feel like, I feel like somebody wants you to come home, or somebody wants you, somebody wants to get you close, so, that, so they can, like, so they can talk a whole bunch of bullshit or gossip, or so that, so they can like spoil your your perspective or spoil your uh the views that you have of this person so i'm thinking like you really like this person they make you happy but yeah some, somebody wants to like kind of contort your views about them so that they're that therefore you turn on them so this, this could be your own sibling this could be your family doing this all right same i'm getting the same thing in all the readings today all right let's see what's the page of pentacles because i'm getting like somebody wants you to abandon somebody else but first you have to first you have to hate this person. You have to see this person as a vile person first before you can hate them, before you move on. So I feel like that's what somebody's working on. Some you somebody first has to make somebody appear like a bad person. Yeah, the Ten of Swords. Somebody, somebody's gonna somebody's gonna tell you that somebody betray you. Um I'm getting one of your siblings could come to could come to you and say, Yeah, this person betray you, or uh your sister's betraying you, or they lied, or something like that. What's the what's the, I just I'm getting like bullshit going on. All right. What's the page of Pentacles? Something going on at your work with your family, something like that. Yeah, the justice. This could be the legal system too. Yeah, I'm being like somebody's trying to get you to to uh, leave your child, or uh, like maybe this is how you feel, or something like that. Or somebody somebody's trying to get you to see something differently, a different perspective. So it's it's almost like. What is the what is the page of Pentacles justice? Eight of Swords. I'm I'm getting like okay. So first of all, I'm getting like somebody's locked up here. Someone's in jail. Yeah, I'm getting like somebody's in and out of jail. Okay. Or some somebody's situation is very unstable with their child, or somebody's stuck in a very unstable situation with their kid here, or something like that. I feel like somebody is literally somebody is locked up. What's what is, what is this, man? Oh, this is this is what some this is what people want you to believe that somebody's in jail when they're not. I mean, like somebody got out two months ago or something like that. But I feel like you know that you knew that you spoke it out, you caught it out, you caught it. All right, what is, the, what is the, uh, but I feel like somebody's still trying to give you the runaround or like some, I, I feel like this is what somebody's trying to keep a secret from, secret from you, that you were right. So maybe, maybe you told some, maybe you told someone that you were going to, they, they were going to get out early. They actually did get out early, but I mean, like somebody does not want you to know that you were right about that. So they just kind of keep you, they kind of keep it a secret or, cause I'm kind of getting, getting like somebody's coming home. And everybody's happy about it, but they don't want you to know. They don't want you to come home. So maybe your father's coming home or your mother's coming home. I mean, like somebody's coming home from jail, but they keep you in the dark about it. They don't want you to know. They don't, they don't want you to celebrate. They don't want you to be happy. Because I'm getting too, if you, they don't, they don't want you to come home and see this person, but they also don't want you, they don't want you to know that you were right the entire time. You were right. So somebody just they they continue they continue to lie about they continue to lie about it. Uh, I'm getting to somebody does not know if a, if a child is theirs or not. All right, what's, what is the six of cups? I'm also getting to a childhood friend is home and they don't want you to know they they could be avoiding you or something like that. What's the six of cups? 
The Ace of Cups, the Three of Swords, yeah. This, somebody, the child is not your kid. It's not your kid. That's not your child, okay? I'm getting like somebody knows that you're not their kid. You're not their kid. That's not their kid. Somebody's kid here is not somebody's shit. For real. That's not your real father or something like that. What's the Six of Swords and the Magician? Yeah, I feel, like, I feel like you already know that, but somebody refuses to admit it. That's not your dad. You're not their kid or that's not their kid or something like that. What's the, what is the Knight of Swords? Because I'm getting you already figured this shit out. You already figured it out. But some, it's, it's almost like somebody, somebody refuses to admit it. They just won't admit the shit or uh, they keep you blind or they keep you, in, they, they keep you going in circles or blah, blah, blah. This could be about a Libran. What's the, what's the Nine of Swords and the Empress? Yeah, the Four of Wands. Yeah, somebody is at home or, or somebody's on house arrest. Somebody got released. What's, what is this? Or, I'm getting like, or somebody's trying to keep you in the system. So I'm getting like, I'm getting like somebody, um, a situation has been over with. But somebody wants to inconvenience you or you want to inconvenience someone. So you, you, keep, you, you keep this charade going on or you, you keep this cycle going on, continuing to... to, to, to uh, to keep somebody in a cycle, keep somebody stuck. Somebody's still trying to keep you stuck. Yeah, what's the, because uh, I'm kind of getting, you can't really move around, maybe because probation, house arrest, I'm getting your own papers, or you can't leave the state. I'm getting, you have to you have to stay in a certain location. Somebody knows that, so it's, it's like somebody's trying to trap you or somebody's trying to create a barrier where you can't get out or you're trapped or something like that. So I'm getting like somebody is managing work here, keeping you stuck. This could be jar work or whatever. Or somebody's trying to keep you from doing this. Somebody wants to keep you silent. So somebody wants to keep you in the Two of Pentacles, Eight of Swords. It's the same. It's 88. So, so I'm getting somebody here was born in 88. Or maybe you were born in 88. I'm also getting something about your birth certificate. Something about a Libra, a double Libra. Maybe your mom's a Libra. You're a Libra. I'm getting a Libra. And Aries is involved. A Leo. You're involved. Okay. What's this? But I'm getting something about your birth certificate was wrong. I'm getting your birthday was wrong or somebody somebody's birthday was wrong on the birth certificate. You know that, but you've been lying to them or they've been lying to you about it. Or like somebody signed a birth certificate for a kid that's not theirs. The kid found out or the, the, you, you don't know how to tell the kid this or now you're stuck or something like that. All right, let's see. I'm just kind of getting like somebody lied. Somebody had somebody lied to you. They've been lying to you your entire life since you were a child. I'm getting your parents, the justice system. Maybe you were in the system and your information got mixed up. Like I'm getting your birthday is wrong. That's not your birthday. That's not your dad or some shit. Because I mean like somebody here was in, was in foster care. Somebody here was in the system for a long time. Shit got mixed up. I'm getting you're going to discover like some secrets about your mom, about your dad, about your birthday, about your kid, about your childhood. Things are gonna start coming back to you. Yeah, some you have been somebody lied to you. All right, what's the what is this combination? Yeah, the nine of cups. I'm getting to you're a genius. Yeah, the will of fortune. You have a hell of a fortune. I'm getting like I'm getting like somebody knows your fortune. They're, they're, they're trying to keep you from it. Or you know somebody else's. You choose the side you want. I'm just getting like somebody has been lying here about a kid. And keeping somebody in the dark about it. What is the three? What is the uh, Ace of Cups, Three of Swords? That's quick. Yeah, because somebody has been getting money, child support. That's why. Yeah, some, I mean, like somebody signed the birth certificate. They owe a whole bunch of money in child support. They've been paying it. And then you're gonna find out that this person's not your father, or that's not even your kid. All right, what's this combination? I'm also getting to something about your DNA. Something about your grandfather. I feel like you need to do research on your grandfather or the man that you call grandfather, the man that you think is your grandfather. I feel like you need to look more into that because I'm getting incest here as well. I'm definitely getting a royal bloodline. The 
queen of wands and the emperor, the empress. Yeah, so you know something. I'm getting you know the secrets, even though people don't admit them. I mean, something's going on with your family here at work or something like that. I'm getting to like somebody has been hiding your mail. Or like, because I mean like somebody's like rushing to the mailbox trying to get to something before you or somebody, somebody is like really in a hurry to come over to your house. Somebody really wants to come over right now. They want to. So I, I don't know. I, I, feel like some, I feel like somebody's hiding their motives, but I, I feel like you already know their motives. You, already know, you know that somebody's inauthentic, somebody's disingenuous. You know that already. I'm kind of getting you're playing along with the magician. Yeah. I'm getting them say shit. Play along. All right. Cards for Sage. Yeah, we have healing. Yeah, the situation is going to heal itself, Sage. But I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting like you're healing from this. This is going to help you heal. I'm getting you're going to know the truth about something. All right. Yeah, we have spot annuity. All of a sudden, the truth is going to come out. I feel like somebody can't hide it from you anymore. You're getting older or you're getting smarter or you're getting hit. You're asking a whole bunch of questions. Yeah, we have dictionary. You, you're, you're communicating. You're talking. Somebody can't hide the truth. Somebody's story is not adding up. I'm getting you're picking somebody apart. They don't they don't have the answers. All right, let's see. Give me a give me a gypsy card, but I'm getting the situation. It's going to be healed. It's, it's going to be over. All right. I'm getting you are gonna find out that somebody betrayed you, somebody lied to you. But I'm getting it is it's you're gonna it's gonna be healed. Okay. We have sigh, yeah. <sighs> Exhale. Okay. The situation is gonna heal itself. I'm getting, I'm getting all of a sudden the situation is gonna just end. It's gonna be over. Like all of a sudden. All right. I'm gonna just chill out. Yeah, we have soldier, yeah, and we have money, yeah. Okay. So I'm definitely I'm getting somebody who was, who was in the military here. So maybe your father was in the military. Okay, you're getting a trust fund, or um Maybe I, I feel like somebody's father was, was like a soldier here who died. I'm getting inheritance. Yeah, somebody here's an army brat, or you I'm, I'm getting like money is coming to you that you didn't know that you had. But that's what somebody has been keeping from you. Like I'm getting the money has just been sitting there. I'm getting it's from it's it's from your granddad. Or something like that. Yeah, haughtiness. I'm getting too like somebody could have spent your money. Like, cause I'm getting like saves, like you're struggling and you really, you have a whole bunch of money somewhere. I feel like somebody knows that. And you're sitting here with the two of pentacles stuck. But I'm getting like, you have a fortune somewhere. There's money like in a vault or a savings account or a CD or something like that. It's, it's your money, it's waiting for you. I'm getting the money has been just maturing. Somebody, I'm getting to like somebody was waiting for you to mature. So maybe you have to reach the age of 30 or you have to reach the age of 30 first. But I'm getting it, I'm getting the money has been maturing for seven years. I'm getting this earth sign. All right, let's see. Give me a card for Sage Sun. Make better fucking choices. Okay, wow. Yeah, so I'm, I'm getting to like somebody, I'm getting like, I'm getting, um, there was inheritance here and it was distributed amongst you and your siblings. I feel like your siblings, they spit theirs. I feel like you never got yours though. I feel like you never got your money. Or you're doing, you, you, uh, you're doing better with your inheritance. You're spending it better. You're investing it better. I'm also getting too. This is the reason why the money is being given to you because of how you invest your money, the, the choices that you make. I'm getting that's why it's being given to you. You're being chosen to manage this. So somebody could be choosing you to. You could be uh, somebody could be choosing you to uh, run their estate or to distribute. You know, to pay all their bills when they die, something like that. 
I'm getting an I'm getting an older earth sign. They they want to give you this or because they feel like you make you make good choices. All right, you know what to do with the money. You're not frivolous. All right, give me a card for Sage Moon. Get over yourself. Pull your shit together. Yeah. Hmm. All right, so I'm getting, I'm getting if you're fine, if you're finding out. I don't know, I, I'm kind of getting like somebody wants a pity party. Cause I'm getting like you're you're trying to find a solution to a problem, but like somebody just somebody wants to be stuck, somebody wants to complain, they want to be heartbroken. So this could be a Leo. Cause I'm, I'm getting like you're you're not cold towards someone, but you're just, you're very logical. You're like, man, it's life. Move on. Shit. But I'm getting like somebody's lying anyway, or like somebody's trying to get you into some, I don't know. Give me a card for uh, Sage Rising. Take a fucking trip. I, what is going on? <laughs> yeah, I feel like somebody wants you to come home. Or, or somebody wants you to come over, or I, I feel like somebody's gonna try to make it seem like they're in a crisis, but they're not. They just they just wanna they just want you to come over, or they just wanna come live with you, or like I feel like this person is always in some shit. They're always in a fucking crisis. They're always stuck or something. Um, I feel like I feel like you're not very loving towards this person, or you just. Cause I feel like two of pentacles, eight of swords, like somebody is always the same story. It's always the something, something's always the same. I'm also getting to like one of your siblings is gonna like stop talking. I feel like I feel like one of your siblings is like a foe. All right, give me give me give me a card for Sage North Note. Get the fuck out of your head. All right. None of those cards make sense to me. So I'm getting a situation that does not make any sense. Something is not adding up here. Yeah, the Ten of Wands. I, I feel like you're trying to make sense of something and it's not adding up. I'm getting, every time you think you have something figured out, it's, there's like another piece of the puzzle or something, somebody comes out of no, nowhere with some new shit or, yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of getting like, I'm getting saved. Like, just, just wait. Like, don't, don't beat yourself up or rack your brain trying to figure some shit out. Just wait. I feel like something's gonna happen. Sometimes it's gonna be illuminated, anyways. Cause I feel like somebody, somebody wants to confuse you. Somebody wants you to be in the dark. Somebody wants you to feel stuck mentally, or somebody wants you to keep trying to figure something out over and over again. Don't do that. Just be easy. Just chill. All right, so I'm gonna leave it there. All right, don't forget to like the video, leave your comments, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.